Uh, first of all, Senator Mayor, thank you very much for stepping in. Appreciate it. And I think you and I both share these concerns for our small businesses. But I can tell you as a business owner myself that uh, you know, this was a devastating impact on all of our businesses. And uh, to go from having to, from, we have businesses that didn't lay off a single person, not a single person during the pandemic that are seeing dramatic increases in their unemployment insurance rates. And uh, what this bill really is doing, as good as it is, uh, is essentially kicking the can down the road because it's not addressing the fundamental problem of a $9 billion, with a B, deficit in our unemployment insurance fund. Now, we may disagree <clears throat> on how that number came about, but I can tell you that <clears throat> New York State has still yet to address how much fraud was in our unemployment insurance. I asked that question of the commissioner of the Department of Labor. She danced around it and said that, well, <clears throat> we, we avoided about $2 billion in fraud. But she wouldn't actually tell us, because I'm sure she doesn't know, how much fraud we actually experienced in our unemployment insurance. And that's really troubling, because <clears throat> other states, including California, have identified that number. <clears throat> and I think that would be justification. <clears throat> excuse me, justification for diverting the unspent federal money that we have to that unemployment insurance fund, because that's what this is really about. This is a good step. It will help us. But ultimately, we are going to have to pay that bill at some point. And right now, we're kicking the can down the road as interest accrues on that $9 billion dollars that is on the backs of every single employer in New York State. That's the troubling part of this. <clears throat> so I really think we need to look at what we spend our money on here in New York State. We have a huge budget surplus. We have unspent federal relief money. And we have yet to address the fundamental problem that every single employer in New York State is paying more in unemployment insurance than they ever have. And according to the Business Council, it's going to take more than a decade to make up that billion, $9 billion surplus if some of that money from the federal government isn't diverted to that fund. A decade on the backs of every single employer in New York State. So this is kind of like a bucket of water in the ocean, quite frankly. Happy to have it. Glad we're doing it. <clears throat> but we need to step up and we need to fill that crater and make sure that that $9 billion deficit is not on the, a burden on our already overburdened businesses in New York State. So, Madam President, with that, I will be supporting the bill. Thank you.